God, I don't want to die. Who will take my place if I do? Jesus told his followers to go into all the world and proclaim the gospel to the whole creation, to every nation, to the ends of the earth. John Chow was a teenager when he took his first missions trip and when he felt called to invest his life to reach the people of North Sentinel Island, who had violently rejected all previous contact with outsiders. John answered that call Here am I. Send me. For the next nine years, every decision John made was with an eye toward going ashore on North Sentinel Island. He served in multiple countries to gain missions and ministry experience. He trained in linguistics to help learn their language. He was certified as an EMT in the hope of serving the tribesmen medically. Once I said yes to Jesus, I was committed. I was all in. I believe that the measure of success in the kingdom of God is obedience. I want my life to reflect obedience to Christ and to live in obedience to Him. I think that Jesus is worth it. He's worth everything. In 2018, with the backing of his missions agency, John went to North Sentinel Island. He knew the risks, but his passion for the North Sentinelese and his desire to be obedient to Christ drove him forward. Sitting in the boat, getting ready to go ashore, John penned a final note and a challenge to his family. You guys might think I'm crazy in all this, but I think it's worth it to declare Jesus to these people. Please do not be angry at them or a God if I get killed. Rather, please live your lives in obedience to whatever he has called you to, and I'll see you again when you pass through the veil. The eternal lives of this tribe is at hand, and I can't wait to see them around the throne of God, worshiping in their own language as Revelation 7, 9 to 10 states. I pray none of you love anything in this world more than Jesus Christ. Within hours of writing those words, John Chow was killed by the Islanders. John believed that the measure of success in the kingdom of God is obedience, and he would be obedient to God's call, no matter the cost. Who will pay the price to go to every tribe, 